Look there. Well, a good Monday morning to you. It's Dan. I want to welcome everyone to my quite chilly home in the sticks. And I hope everybody's having a good start to a new week. But over here in East Central Mississippi, I am here to tell you it is 19 degrees right now. I actually woke up to 11 degree temperatures. So it is unbelievably cold here in East Central Mississippi. Before we get started on today's video, I'm always going to say that if you are new to the channel, I want to welcome you. And if you're returning just to see what old Dan's got going on over her, I show enough thank you for coming back. But what I want to share with you and y'all today is I'm just going to give you a little weather update. I have a lot that's been going on for the last couple of days, so we're going to bump some gums about it. Give me a second. That's what we fit in the dues. <laughs> Man, what in the far is going on in East Central Mississippi? Well, I'm here to tell you, we are under a, a winter weather, a severe winter weather warning. I guess that's how you would term it. And it, uh, it's, it actually it just stopped uh, with the uh, ice rain, or yeah, I guess that's what they call it, the icy rain. And what I've been having to do probably, well, what I have been doing the last couple of days is every hour or so, I'm actually having to come out here and bust the ice on all of the water troughs for the animals. Uh, my uncle's been coming over as well. I'm sure you can hear that crunchiness. That is the ground. Lord have mercy. But what I'm doing is, oh, feels like it's starting to sleet again. But I'm having to come out here and bust those water troughs just to make sure that the animals have uh, water to drink. What I've been doing with the chickens, um, actually having to haul water out. All of the water is a frozen over. And yeah, that's, I guess that's what you have to do. Uh, that's what I'm having to do. So look there. So we're expecting quite a few more days of this weather. From what I understand, it's going to be, it's going to get really bad this evening and possibly Tuesday and Wednesday. The really bad thing about it is we do not, we seldomly get uh, weather like this here in East Central Mississippi. Uh, Mississippi, maybe uh, Northern Mississippi gets weather like this. But for uh, me to get single digit uh, weather uh, attempts, not good at all. Uh, we got down to, uh, I want to say, uh, 9 degrees with the wind chill. So it's just really, really cold. And the, the animals and the trees and everything over here is just having fits because they are not used, they're not used to this type of weather. Look there. So the whole pool is pretty much frozen over. Heck, I can get in some winter sports and get me some ice skates and go skating on this joker. <laughs> but yes, this is what I'm dealing with over here. Uh, a lot of my friends over here that live close to my home place are all uh, farmers. A lot of them have livestock, uh, cows, things like that. And they are just playing heck with this weather, especially if you have 50, 100 head of cow out in your pasture and there's no way uh, for them to drink water because all of the watering troughs are frozen. So uh, it's a really, really, really bad thing right now uh, here at the home place. Uh, and I don't want to make it seem like it's, it's, not, it's something that we're just going to have to deal with, but I want to make the point of it's something that seldom happens over here. It gets cold, yes, we get down uh, below freezing for a few days, no big deal, but it warms up, everything thaws out and we're good to go. But when you get uh, a week of 10 degree, 15 degree weather, it's something else uh, for us over here. And I want to wish everybody well that is in these uh these winter storms that are rolling through it's just uh i don't know it's it's unbelievable i've been monitoring the weather channel 
and I just see people getting slammed with ice and snow. So um, if you're in those conditions, please stay safe. One of the other big things uh, that's, that's really bad for me over here is the power lines. When it rains and then it gets really cold, the power lines get iced up. So a lot of folks lose power over here. Haven't, knock on wood, haven't lost any, any power here as of yet, but a buddy of mine was telling me just about five miles up the road they had power line workers uh, that were working on a line about five miles from me. Maybe I'm not in that grid, so thank goodness. But that's another thing that I have to deal with over here. Good thing that I have a wood burning heater and I have propane to uh, cook with, so that's good too. So uh, I'm gonna end this video. Depending on the weather and whether or not I lose that electricity, I'm gonna try to get this video uploaded today like I would normally do, but if not, it'll be tomorrow morning. So again, I hope everybody is having a good Monday and I hope everybody stays safe this week amid this crisis that we still have going on. If you uh, like this video, go on and give it a thumbs up, they help. If you haven't subscribed to the Home the Sticks channel, Lord of mercy, y'all need to come on over here, give old Dan a look, because I'm always doing stuff, even in the cold. With that being said, you know it's coming, Dan, reference show enough, always gonna say it. Don't let nobody dull your shine. And I mean nobody, you show enough, get your shine on, stay warm, be you. And Dan will see you and y'all in the next video.